In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can take some important steps towards earning money off of your YouTube videos. The first thing you need to do is have a YouTube channel and some video content. In this case, my YouTube channel has a simple logo here, a little bit of channel art, and I've got a lot of video content. To date, I have over 100 videos that I've uploaded. Make sure that your YouTube content follows these key rules in order to be monetized. First, you need to make sure that you follow YouTube's guidelines. These are extensive guidelines that YouTube puts out explaining things like harassment, sensitivity to some viewers, inappropriate language, violence, hate speech, and other things of this nature. Next, make sure that you're creating all elements by yourself. Some of your content can be borrowed if you give attribution, but if you want to make money on YouTube, have a concept that you are creating yourself. Make sure you own necessary rights to commercially use certain visuals. This can apply to things like music and video clips you intend to use to support your videos. Finally, make sure that you are advertiser friendly. This is similar to the YouTube guidelines, but basically advertisers want content that isn't inappropriate to many viewers and gives them a wide audience where they can place their ads. So once you've followed these guidelines and created video, you're gonna upload it to YouTube. In order to do that, you'll find on your channel, up in the upper right hand corner, this create button where you can click and upload a video. While uploading your video, you will have a list of fields to fill in. Do not skip over these because these have a lot to do with how well your video will perform on YouTube. First, create a catchy title. Make mention of keywords like programs used, activities, and give the viewer a clear understanding of the video that you're posting. Next. Add in some descriptive text. Make sure you are including things like keywords that reference your title. Also, make sure to attribute any music you use for your video, if it is available for commercial use. Finally, add in links to any other pages or platforms where you may want to get followers. Create a catchy custom thumbnail that is large enough for people to read and see. This is going to attract people to want to come and click on your video. If your video fits into a playlist of similar videos that you're uploading, Select that playlist. If your video is not directly geared towards kids, make sure to select Not for Kids. Take some time making good tags for your video. Tags should be, again, keywords that people will search for your video. Think of how you would look for a particular piece of content on YouTube. Pick a category for what makes sense for your video. There's many different categories to pick from. Add an end card to your video. Some options can be suggesting another video or can be to subscribe to your channel. In order to monetize your video, you will have to have completed a couple of steps. First off, you'll have to have a Google AdSense account. You can create this by signing up for Google AdSense and just doing a YouTube search to find it. You'll also need to qualify for monetization. Currently, YouTube is asking that a channel have 1,000 subscribers or more and have had 4,000 watch hours or more in the past year. This may sound like a lot, but it's really not valuable to you to not have met these criteria and you won't earn any money. The best practice is to just set a goal for yourself. Start off by forcing yourself to make at least one video a day for two months or 60 videos. You should start seeing good results once you do that if you follow these steps. Pay attention to your analytics. Sort your top viewed videos and see if there are any other videos that you can make that are relevant to topics that you've already done. Check the comments for any useful insights or questions and engage with your viewers. This will keep them interested in your content. Also, pay attention to your likes versus your dislikes. If you're not getting above an 80% like rate, you may need to reevaluate your content. There are many other ways to get your YouTube content set off on the right path, but these are just a few core things to keep in mind when getting started. Best of luck and stay tuned to this channel for more videos like this.